for a video I wasn't sure about making. This has taken a lot of making. The FX803 has been an absolute blast. Um, I enjoyed learning to fly with the QF008 as the first plane. It too had twin props, but this is just a two-channel affair with no control surfaces whatsoever. No rudder, no elevator, no ailerons. So how does it fly, you may ask? Brilliantly. Just as the joke goes, my dog has no nose, how does it smell? Bloody awful. This plane is amazing. The two channels involved just control the propellers. Forward will take you both up and faster. That's the left stick. The two props will spin. The one on the nose is a dummy. The right hand side prop uh, stick controls the turns. So one of the motors will turn more than the other and take you one way or the other. A long pull of these will make the aircraft dive down slightly to that side. But short taps or bump turns, as Quadcopter 101 puts it, will take it much more smoothly in the air as you travel. I may demonstrate that later. Uh, yeah, in the flight. The FX803 is a 30 centimeter wingspan plane. It's got a very small battery, not as small as most, and it's very easy to control. It's not gonna teach you how to fly multi-channel planes, but it'll certainly give you the confidence to throw something in the air and give it a go. Um, how does it fly? As I said, brilliantly. Um, controls are simple, but intuitive. The glide is fantastic for such a small plane it's heaps of fun i have no affiliation it retails about 20 pound i got this second hand off ebay for less than that and i can honestly say it's worth way more than double it glides brilliantly obviously you need quite calm weather with any plane polystyrene or not it weighs all of 33 grams as a flight weight including the battery um all I can say is it gives fun in heaps. If you've never bought a remote control plane or tried one, this is the one to try. Um, what can I say? About 10 minutes of flight time, maybe a little bit more. Glides brilliantly. Smooth in the air when you do the bump turns. Confidence builder by the bucket load. Um, yeah, get one tomorrow if you can. You might have to wait 20 to 50 days on most sites, but yeah. The FX803, ladies and gentlemen, a two channel trainer. Um, gonna do a short unboxing in a minute. That's easy to fly, fun to pick up, and yeah, just great fun. Um, any questions or comments, leave them below. Here's the unboxing bit uh, you get two spare props in the box. The elastic bands are wrapped around there to hold the camera I was filming with while flying. Um, and as I say, the sticks have only one way to move each. Uh, the false prop at the front just turns in the wind. There's the two spare props and the charger. You can attach landing gear if you uh, so wish, but we flew above a lot of grass, so we didn't bother. Even got an on-off on switch just above the battery canopy. It's so well designed. Full of stability, so no loops, no rolls. But what it doesn't do, it gives back in heaps. The battery there is a 220 milliamp one cell affair, 3.7 volts, bigger than most trainer plane batteries. Here it is in the air again. I'll play out with this footage to be honest, I think I've talked enough. Thank you for watching, like and subscribe. Hope this video works, I've tried a number of times. I wasn't even going to review it, but I thought it was well worthy of a mention. It's one of the best beginners planes and the most fun to fly of any plane we've ever flown. Um, thanks again. Stay safe, stay alert, wherever the new message is, take care. Bye for now.